Sean Gaither has been helping strangers for 10 years. Working in emergency response, he's been one of the unseen voices on the receiving end of a 911 call. Unfortunately, we deal with people's worst days. Uh, no one calls dispatch when they're having a good day. As director of a 911 dispatch center, he leads a team of guardian angels. I've experienced some of the worst calls you can take. We've had some success stories in my career that, you know, we've done CPR on individuals and, you know, me guiding him through CPR has uh, helped save a life. Unfortunately, some situations are beyond help. On one weekend, Sean's team learned of two fatalities involving young people. When you get a call that results in the loss of life of any young person, it definitely plays a, a huge role in your feelings and emotions. And you, you're trying to put those aside, but at the end of the day, we're all human. After the tragedy, Sean saw that his staff needed emotional support. Through a friend, he was connected with the FirstNet team at AT&T, whose communications network for first responders offers Labradoodles and Golden Doodles as therapy dogs. I thought it would be a great surprise for them um, to bring in the therapy dog and to spend, you know, spend, spend a few hours with them and, you know, lighten some of the tension up that had, you know, happened because of the two weeks of tragedies that we had in our community. And I felt that it would be a great tool for them to be able to relax a little bit more enjoy the day uh, with the therapy dog. They were all ecstatic, you know, that we had a dog here and, you know, they were just appreciative of uh, FirstNet and at t for reaching out and to make it happen. One of the puppies from the program was more than happy to offer cuddles and comfort to Sean's team. The people that sit behind those headsets, they are responsible for the people in this community and our first responders, just like law enforcement, fire departments, emergency medical services. Our staff go through depression they go through anxiety, they go through the anxiousness of not knowing what outcomes are gonna come from a call. But having a program where a therapy dog can be brought into your agency to help console your staff, to help make them know how appreciative they are and seeing their interaction with the therapy dog, I believe is very crucial to what we do.